Pirates coming out on top. And actually, that's going to be the last right up here. We're going to be going live. And World Noise, you can do the roster rundown for Pirates if you'd like. All right, on Team Pirate, we have Yosh, Grin, Razor, and Kekri. We have for a second. Oh, nice charge back in the safe from Hunter. Also landing on Grin on top of this, the safe room. And that was actually double cap in the back, back in the safe room. But Alice somehow got cleared. The, the jockey land and then got pushed off somehow. And that will be the first stack going down. And obviously for Sorry, just... Sorry go ahead. No, what was this bitter trying to do? I didn't see it. <laughs> this bitter trying to do the tail berry and then it landed in the safe room. It was like this tiny little puddle anyway. So, uh, it's just really funny looking. And actually, you're still going in for the crown and misses completely. Grin uh, jerks the a bit there, but then also for Voodoo Boys, we're gonna have Bullhead Monkey. I believe that is Marvels, and I'm not too sure who the person with the S is. I can't see his name. I think it's Silver. Yeah, there. Thank you. And we will have an attack coming in here. Smoker lands briefly on the Kekri each. Hunter lands out on the coach, but will get clear right away. And Charger gets a couple punches out on him. Actually, that was Nick who got pinned. My bad. Yeah, I mean they they definitely put out a lot of damage in the past two hits. The witch was a huge source of that obviously was the SI demon hit on a just kind of a jerk store occurred. But uh Grin is permanently bleeding at this point in time and we have a tank. Uh, we'll be coming up at 71%. They're currently at 43%, so they're getting closer to spawning here, but they're not there just yet. And uh, we're going to see another attack commence right here pretty soon. It, uh, and also, if World Noises mic is a little low, guys, let me know, and I'll try to turn her up or have her do it somehow. Um, you sound a little low to me, but I don't know how it sounds for them. Yeah, let me know. I'll try and talk louder. Yeah. But we do have another attack coming in right there, and it did get shut down fairly easily there by Team Pirates. And uh, once again, for those of you that might not know Yar is literally their tag, so that's you know, Pirates Yar. So you're not gonna see P I R or anything. Indeed it is, and that's another thing I should also point out. We do have war rooms for both of these teams, so uh, what flavor are you feeling for this first tank? Oh, I think infected right now. All right, let's send it right up. <laughs> It's all good. No. Shout out to He's Ace. black and white. Love you. Right. Alright, uh, get that boomer up top. Do you want to try to get a hit for him real fast? Or? Sure, sure. Uh, let me get... Uh, yeah. Ready to go in a second. Reloading! Hold the boomer. One second. Yes. Shoot the tank. Not really. Yeah, just hold boom. I got his boomer. Right. Yeah, just jump over that fence there. Oh, Going I did now. anyone but Rochelle. Anyone but Rochelle. Try to push him towards the boomer. Yeah, that'll help. I'm coming from the top. Right, let's open. Nice punch. Nice punch. We are back from the war room of Voodoo Boys. Tank was in the hands of Bullhead there, and what do you make of that tank world? Reload. Uh, I think he overcommitted a little bit there, but uh, he did get that incap on Rochelle. Reload. But I think it could have. I don't know. I, I mean, it's all about timing. It wasn't really anything to do other than. Reloading. Let's cut through the garage safe. Yeah, I mean, there really wasn't much, as you said, that they could have done there. Uh, obviously, Rochelle is black and white now, so that's going to be a big factor playing out into the rest of the map here. They might actually want to try to get the kill out of Rochelle. That's probably the best bet here instead of going directly for the health bonus. We're going to have an attack coming in here, though. Hunter Gang finally skied there by the hands of Kerfi. Charger missed completely on the coach, gets one punch onto him, and will get shut down finally. And we will have Asaris pushing the way up to the safe from here. There will be one more brief attack, but... uh. Once in back that tank, it really was the much he could have done. Uh, if he actually focused on the car any longer, he would have taken a lot more chip, and obviously would have been an unable to commit at that point. But uh, they they made what they could happen, and uh, you know they're, they're gonna have to work with it. Oh, 
the attack of man air. Hunter getting seed, but a nice double cap still landing out there by the smoker and jockey hands. And a boomer will briefly go out onto her shell. She's not going to die from this boom, I hope. But uh, she will be able to make it in safe range. Survivors are still sitting at a good health bonus right now. Up to a 264. Not too shabby for this map. But uh, it could definitely be better. And let's see if Voodoo Boys can manage to make that happen. Yeah, really well done by Team Pirate. Surprisingly, they only have 260 bonus for having three permanent. Ask me a question. God damn. Oh, three cool. Well, I guess at the same time, Rochelle was black and white. Um, I know the whole black and white thing, the amount of downs kind of, does kind of affect the health bonus all the way across the board with the survivor's health. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to work, but it, it appears to be how it does. Don't quote me on that, Jacob. Don't get mad if I'm wrong. I could be completely wrong about that. Yeah, I will be the last person ready up here because I'm that good. And we are... Are we live? I can't even tell. Uh, no, there you go. No, yeah, no. that had to happen. I was waiting. I'm like, I don't think we're live, but we are live now. So we're going to go and get the second half underway for you guys. Team Voodoo Boys over on Survivor side with Pirates. Yar over on the SI. Attack spawning up top. Ellis all alone right now. Gets hunted, but gets pounced down to the ground there. I'm actually surprised there wasn't some fall damage. And Jockey will also land out on the coach. Charges in the backfield. Climbing over the fence here. And uh, is going to try and go for a punch or two onto one of the Survivors here. Ellis is really lucky there because he's the only one on top and he, he's one of the two people that had a gun. So if he hadn't fallen down with the hunter like that, it could have been fake damage. Ellis getting the crown, who is bullheaded. Attack yeah. is up. Got a jockey hunter, smoker, and one still in spawn. Spitter. Yeah, it looks like they're not going to be able to find their spawns here, though, so they're going to back out and opt to just hit in the alley up ahead, it looks. I, don't know, I would have liked to have gone personally earlier, that way you know you have a, an attack up for tank. But at this point, they can just take this hit and go spawn tank. Reloading. Yeah, pretty much. I guess they just couldn't find the spawns, that was the whole thing there. Reloading. Yeah. That will happen. Indeed it will. And we will see Voodoo Boys just kind of baying this attack out here, kind of ducking in and out of the buildings, uh, faking the SI out. But they are going to finally commit. A hunter does land out the Nick with the spit. Jockey also lands onto Ellis inside of the spit. Going to be a brief amount of damage. Smoker pulling Ellis back into the spit. And actually, Bully run back into the spit there a bit on his own accord, or a record. And uh, that's going to be quite a bit of damage out onto Bully, actually. But they're definitely sitting at a better point than what we saw Pirates that were on that last half going to tank. Well, they will have an attack. Tank is up in the hands of Kekery. Indeed we shall, and I'm, I'm, I'm guessing you would like another SI Warroom here for Pirates oh. action? Yes, please. Indeed we will make that happen. I thought one of the, the players for Pirates actually DC'd. I only saw three on my HUD. We will go ahead and send it over to Pirates of Warroom for you guys. Please. Okay. Uh, maybe I can land this car. You wish. Yes! Go! Yes. <laughs> nice try. Just go. Just go like that. Yeah. Just go like this. What are you doing? Come on. Oh my god, just don't pause. I was just stuck. <sighs> what the fuck? Doesn't matter, I got this now. <laughs> Let him play. Yeah. What? Okay, I can. Go, go, and we are back from the worm of the pirates. I love Kekri. He, he gets so emotional with this tank play and everything. Oh my god.
Kaku, you're well, amazing. Well, you did really well getting us corner, but Some Survivor team do. was just able to shut down all support, so... Ammo! Uh, Let's cut through the garage sale! Ammunition! Sorry, I'm trying to open up another slot for Fig Newtons. He would like to come in and spectate this game, it appears. Um, but I guess one of the players are the ones that have to call the votes, so we'll get and get that uh, situated next half, I'm assuming, once the next map loads up. But we'll have an attack at att att actually commencing right now. Hunter Jockey working the way in from the back. Charger from the front. Everything missing. Only thing landing was that jo Jockey Hunter, actually. And I'm surprised that Jockey landed. That's going to be a lot of damage out of the survivors. Charger running around like a rampaging bull and getting some nice hits on the survivors. And survivors will go ahead and try to clear Alice, or actually Coach. I mean, he's actually going to take that down. I highly doubt they're going to be able to get this clear on him. So yeah, he's going to take it down. He wasn't held bonus anyway, so it was really good separation, but unfortunately just not on a target that was worth more. Yeah, not a favorable target, but uh, Coach is black and white right now. I doubt he's going to take a death, though. They have a lot of pills still stashed on him, and save from his one hit away, pretty much. There are, they are currently sitting at a 400 approximately health bonus, though. I'm sure they're going to bleed out a little bit, even if they don't take this hit hard. Um, health bonus is still going to drop a bit by the time they make it there. That was actually probably the weirdest survivor model I've ever seen. Rochelle did get hit by the charger, but she kept moving, like her body just kept moving off to the side. And then when she got cleared, it kept sliding. That's weird. Oh, hell yeah. We will see Voodoo Boys make the safe one with a 372 health bonus, bringing them up to a 112 point differential coming into the second map here. Um, I have to remember to allow Fig into the server here. So, give me one minute, guys. But well, what did you think of that first map? Uh, was it what you, is it what you expected coming into this game, or was it uh, too close for your call? Well, I, I anticipated a close game, but I, it's gonna. It looks like it's gonna be a high-scoring yeah. game. So. Yeah, I mean, if they keep playing this way, we could definitely see both teams here mm -hmm. pop over the 3,000, 3,500 mark by the end. And let me go ahead and see if we can get this. Alright, so we will get the slots open up for Fig Newtons, who wants to come in once again and spectate. And it looks like that is the vote. My vote passed somehow? Oh, it changed. Okay. So slots should be set to the correct amount right now. Fig Newtons is joining, and we are going to be going live here with the second round of uh, Vo Voodoo Boys versus the Pirates. I'm going to see what they manage to do here, or what they can uh, plot against the survivors. They do have that spit charge though, so they are probably um, thinking about that spit charge inside. That's probably the most effective way to use this attack here, especially with that hunter to actually uh, complement the attack. Sweetheart, don't shoot me. Attack does make its way in though. Good. Oh, double charge, but only one target in the Oh, she should have just eaten the jockey. It would have been better. <laughs> yeah, actually, it probably would have been. It would have gave her a brief uh, amount of god frames there. It probably saved her from the end cap entirely. But we are going to see Survivor's taking a full end cap after the first hit. Silver taking the down on the chin. And Survivor's going to keep making a lead to the map here. Tank will be up at 20%, so fairly early, and it's going to be in the hands of Yash. And then, which we will be seeing at 65% away, which will be out in the opening before the huge mill, I believe. Reloading here! Reloading! Reloading! Charging! Reload! Oh, this is not... This is 
And we will have a tank coming up, or not a, a tank, but a tank coming up in the hands of Yashir, as previously stated, for Team Pirates. And what, what kind of war room are you feeling, world? We're going to keep going off what you think. Uh, I'm going to say Survivor. See how they're going to handle this bleed. Well, let's send it right over to Voodoo Boys War Room. Rock. 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 Really? Yeah, you want to push? push forward? Uh, yeah, let's go. Really? Let's go now. Give him Give pills. Him. Let's go. Yeah, let's watch the rock. Watch the rock. Yeah, Door. Alright. Let's go. Girl, you should have stayed at home. Push. Kill all the common. Most common are dead. They're all not groups and shit. Rock Watch the boomer spawn too at the corner. Watch it. He's pushing in, he's in. Shoot him, make sure we're shooting him. We are back from the war room of the, the Voodoo Boys actually for that tank in the hands of Yash. And uh, he definitely got some damage out onto Bullhead and Bolt Silver. But other than that, the survivors really didn't take all that much damage. We still see, I believe, that is Monkey and Marvel sitting at well above 70, 80 health. And uh, what else would you like to add to that? That double boom was fantastic and a great commit off that. So, really well done. But yeah, they just did a really good job of shutting... There was a double cap too, but they, they just cleared that. They did really well. Smoker coming out, getting a pull in the back. Boomer only getting a one. Charges got done. Charges just missing. Better free spins. Smoker... Gets a ticker too, maybe. And kiss me the boomer. I love being boomer. What are you gonna spectate for you? Did that fix it? Yes, it did. Yeah. Thank god I have those mac the not my not micros, the macros now. My whole keyboard is like one huge bind. But yeah, we'll see if Survivor just keep pushing out here up to elevator. There will be a witch though, I believe, somewhere in the opening here. And indeed she is. It will be a hunter up though, looking to contest this, gonna try and pounce on it, looks tr might just circumvent the survivors and try to get to the witch. Indeed he's gonna do just that, trying to make it through, it finally does make it, but he's actually pretty chip. He's down to 139 HP, looking for the pounce onto her shell, not on Angel Lane, but gonna run for a scratch or two, actually gets put, shoved away by her shell. And uh, this could be an easy crown here, there is still a spawn up though, yeah, there, there's that boom and jockey, but they're not gonna come in, they're just gonna hold for the staircase up ahead. And that will... Thinking, yeah, they're, they're foregoing that witch for this, this stair head, getting rid of what they didn't need. Yeah, so good sacking order by pirates. Probably gonna get that smoker, if I'm not mistaken. They probably, no, they did get the smoker, so they have the perfect setup pretty much. Uh, just sacking the boomer to slow down the survivors so the SI can get set up, but they have a smoker, charger, and jockey here. So they could make a wipe happen here pretty easily, actually. Um, Jockey will actually get a full recharge, instant recharge right away, pretty much, if he ledge hangs someone. And then Smoker's Tongue will also recharge fairly fast. Obviously, Charger, if he takes one off, they're going off, so that's going to be an end cap. One of those little jockey bastards around here. Coach cuts the tongue, kills the Smoker, Jockey gets picked, Charger's left with Not much, and that's the attack. That's actually highly disappointing, because if the Charger actually didn't botch up that charge, and he actually did hit Nick, he would have went straight off, but it looked like the Charger aimed too far to the right and hit the pole. And uh, mm -hmm. it's a little unfortunate, because he actually got the stumble on Nick, but once again, if he aimed more to the left, he would have hit Nick and taken him off. So a little bit of misplay there. Um, but yeah, I mean, they still have a couple attacks here. Definitely take down Voodoo's health bonus. Voodoo are currently sitting at 516 health bonus. And uh, I'm not too sure what Fig needs help with. <laughs> I don't think he's just pressing keys on his keyboard. Double boot coming out. Hunter making it land on health bonus, but getting cleared. Smoker gets shut down. And elevator's just about here. So. The team 
Yeah, definitely. I mean, also, though, we can't really take Yar out of the picture yet. By no means, actually. I mean, the score is extremely close, and uh, Yar had some amazing survivor play, and I can only expect that they're going to come back with a big round of their own here if uh, the Voodoo Boys do manage to keep this health bonus going into the safe room, which they actually kind of have to hope for, because I wouldn't put anything past Pirates making, you know, being able to make a comeback or, you know, take the lead with this map, even as it stands right now. But, uh, we will have another tech. Initiating very shortly here. Jack coming in and looking for that pass on the coach. We'll get death stopped and cut down though. Hunter does land on to one of the survivors. I'm not sure if that's a DP or just a normal pounce. He might have missed. And we will have a charge of run around getting a couple punches out on the Marvels, who is helping us. Drops him down to red. So good heads up play there by the Charger. And Charger's actually going to back out and wait for another side. No, he's actually coming. Gets the final uh, punch out on the Marvels and gets down. He had 18 HP before that encounter as well. I, I thought that Charger was going to be fairly useless, but... I have to no, ask... Not useless at all. This car seems like it's always tipped up like this nowadays. I'm not too sure if it's something yeah. with a config. Looks like somebody got into an accident and it, like, it's like floating on time. invisible. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We will have a boomer going in and initiating that on to Alice though. Jockey trying to make something happen and latches onto Coach, dragging back on the side and gets it down onto him. And ooh, Boomer with a nice tri proxy will be a full boom out onto them. And there's still a jockey with the smoker. Smoker pulls Nick out of the safe room. That is not helpful on us, but he might take it down here. No, he'll get cleared. And Jockey's sitting on top of the safe room. They don't know. He scratches down the shell and latches back on the Nick. We don't have time for this Smoker's still up. Here he comes to prevent the pickup, but he's not going to. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think Pirates could definitely take the lead here. I mean, they need about a 400 health bonus, give or take a few points, but they could definitely probably make a comeback here and take the lead if, uh, you know, the play is tanked correctly. Their map isn't really all that bad as a lot of people make it out to be. I think it's fairly even, and we're going to have a quick ready up here going in the second half of the second map. And we are going to see Team Yar Pirates over on Survivor with Voodoo Boys on Infected. And, uh, yeah, that last SI, SI hit was pretty crazy. Um, Jackie literally just sat on top of the safe door when it was opened and just looked down at the survivors scratching the door and I, I guess the survivors never heard him or something. Jackie will try to attempt to initiate here on the Nick though. We'll get shut down. Hunter looking for a pounce on this. one of the survivors. We'll land on to Ellis and nice double charge. Triple charge going out. Spit it will also land down on the survivors. That's going to be a lot of spit damage going on to Pirates earlier on. Oh yeah. What an amazing attack by King Voodoo Boys. Really. That's what you want to see. Uh, yep. That gets you hyped when you're, when you're infected. Yeah, that was absolutely beautiful play there. Uh, Hunter initiating, getting the stumbles out to survivors. But uh, they made a mistake of all turning around to get the clear on the Hunter. They should have kept someone, lo someone looking forward. They knew there was a charger that was yet to come in. And uh, he made him pay for that. We have a smoker jockey trying to initiate here as tank does spawn up in the hands of silver. Nice tri boom landing out. Still a smoker hunter though to contest with. Hunter lands onto the unboomed survivor. And smoker's looking for the instant pull, but we'll get melee away and shut down. Should be killed. There we go. And once again, tank is up in the hands of silver. What more what, what do you want, Juan? Tell me what you're feeling. Uh, I'm feeling uh, Team Pirate. I want to see. Or hear Kekri scream when you take Alright, let's send it right over to Pirates Orum. This is Kekri. Tu want to put Push, 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 push
Oh, one is already Careful with the boomer, yeah. Only one. Oh. I'm coming. 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 I'm Smoke, 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 smoke. Ok, let's push. Push. Rock, rock. Reloading. 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 I thought you would have him. He's green. He's getting him. Look at me. Okay. I'm tough. Uh, nice. Let's go. And then we got back from that worm of the pirates for the tank in the hands of silver. You heard the survivor side of the story. Um, I'm sure that's why we're actually pretty happy about the way the tank turned out. Rogue Noise, go ahead and give us a brief rundown. Well, the tank was doing a really good job keeping LOS and getting rocks, and I think the survivors were... Reloading. That's why I like uh, this map, is you, you kind of don't want to stay in one spot if you can, and you keep moving and keep his LOS down, because it's really easy to get LOS everywhere, so... As long as they did okay in fighting the tank, I mean, they still have, what is it, 400 health bonus. Smoker gets a full back, getting cleared, spinner spawns up, but nobody else does. I think Charger's gonna save it, maybe Witch or Stairs, one or the other. I mean, Rochelle is gonna go ahead and go for this crown, actually gets spit the light there by the spitters, throwing his life away at Bullhead. And, uh, yes, which should be... Actually spawns up to actually scare the survivors off and will scare them enough for Rochelle to go for the draw crown and I'm I'm happy she got that draw crown. I thought that was gonna go really bad for the survivors there. And actually Rochelle is pretty much almost half of the health bonus that remains. Probably more like a third. But uh we will be see this yeah, really good crown. yeah, she actually got really aggro and I didn't think that he was actually gonna go for her. I thought he was gonna let her calm down, but instead they actually uh, went for the draw crown instead of these straight up uh you know just run up to her and default crown. But we will see the SI setting up for this attack up top here. Raids are kind of bidding out. He isn't health bonus. He's all bleed pretty much. So uh, he is the correct person to ha be having bait here. And there's a hunter spawn up right around the corner. I'll, I'll be surprised if he doesn't see him when he peeks around that corner again. And then obviously there is also that charger and boomer below. And that other spawn's probably a jockey. Yeah, this is a jockey. We have the SI coming in hunting to get skeeted though. Charger going, look for that charge, misses completely. Jockey gonna be forced to drop down the second floor and only go for a snag on the coach. That will be all she wrote for that attack with the bummer landing on Alice as well. And I believe that charger did get away, indeed it did. So he's gonna go ahead and grab himself a despawn probably. Yeah, he had 274 HP, so he's one level. 
spinner coming up. Let's see what else they have. Hunter and Smoker. Dude, so they have a pretty good setup. Charger's gonna work his way right. Gets shut down immediately, though. Smoker getting a brief pull out on the Nick. Not getting cleared yet as Alice is reloading. Hunter's still pouncing around. Look for target does land out onto her shell. Hitting part of that health bonus. And, uh, I mean, they got some good damage yet, but unfortunately, it all went on to Nick pretty much as he was one that was pulled through the spit. And that's not health bonus, though, so definitely uh, a better target could have been selected there. Unfortunately, for. Yeah, so we will see uh, Pirates pretty much having to play a picturesque, perfect uh, game here for the rest of the map if they want to keep it close, if not take the lead. I don't even think they can take the lead, actually. With 328 now. No, they that's, just have to keep up. Yeah, that's like a 64 lead they have right now. That's, yeah, they, can't, they, can't, they can't take the lead, but they can definitely keep it close, if not close that point gap. And we're going to see actually a pretty good hit here lined up for the SI. Smoker with a charge to complement, with the spitter to complement, and actually Ray's going to take it down by one of the common in the field, and this will trigger the attack. Smoker gets a nice pull out of Rochelle, that is part of the health bonus. Uh, Charger will look for target, actually does land out onto Rochelle, and that's going to be a down under, that's going to be all the health bonus she had gone, and Razor has to get cleared, so he might die from the common, and that was actually a pretty nice hit. I mean, Yash still has all of his health, though, but... Yeah, full nice. HP Smoker circling Ellis, who still has the remainder of health bonus at 57. And so I was able to push board. Indeed. Yeah. That's and I should actually go ahead and point out once again, if you guys haven't, go ahead and head over to watchlafeta.com. Um, we'd actually recommend you guys watch the cast from that site. It helps support us and whatnot, and uh, just you know puts the activity on the website. Um, a Stoopy did actually just get done remodeling the website. It looks completely different from what it was. And we have a nice dual cap going on in the back. That is going to be... Actually, the help bonus still isn't being hit, but Nick will take it down way back in the field. And we're going to see Grin and Crookery make their way back. Razor is black and white now once it gets up. Oh, nice on the they're boomed on as well. I'm slow. That's their health bonus gone. We got time for this. Get up. Now there's three attacks and only Alice. I can't do this. Yeah, Smoker still full health. I ain't leaving. Oh, no. one HP. That's that's the round. I do that it will be the end of the round. That will bring Pirates' total score for the second map up to 1,239. And uh, we're going to see Voodoo Boys coming out of the second map here with about a 400, 425 point lead, I believe, if my math is correct. So uh, definitely a point spread starting to open up here for Voodoo Boys. And we have to you know, hopefully see Pirates get a wipe here on the third map and tr make a comeback of some sorts, um, whether it just be distance or actually making some health bonus in the safe room. Yeah, for those of you in chat asking about Watch Left 4 Dead, some people told me before that it's redirecting to some school website. Um, I'm not too sure what that's about. It works for me. It might just be that some of your... I don't know. Try clearing out your caches and stuff. Um, I, I don't know. I don't believe a stupid change domains or anything. So he that should all be good. But um, yeah, clear out your caches and everything. Uh, see if that works. But yeah, the website's totally redone. It looks absolutely amazing I love the new look of it and uh, the scroll bar you can actually click on the stream tab and scroll with it it's really addicting I did it for literally 10 minutes while I watched some other streams before and uh, yeah, it's just a really fun thing I, I love it good job to a stoopy and uh, yeah, needless to say we're gonna be going live here with the third map here I am joined by the one and only left to learn world noise and this is gonna be tanked right off the bat actually so quickly what war are you feeling Let's throw right over to Pirate Worm as this tank in the hands of Razor throws this rock and it lands out onto Nick. Let's toss it over to them. 
Ah, oh. oh, I can't do it. Ça tombe au ping. Maybe boom a left. And we are back once again from that war room for the pirates. Tank was in the hands of. Oh, don't film me now. I think it was Rezzer. Was it... Am I right? No, it was Yosh. It was Yosh. Yeah. Retrace our steps. Head through the field. Well, you're lying to me. It was Razor. Oh, it was Razor. Never mind. <laughs> I'm like, is Rome messing with me? <laughs> no, yeah. Whoops. Like, we're. Yes, yeah, so we actually saw a nice. Yeah, we saw a nice bit of damage. Actually, another attack coming in. Our smoke gets a free pull out on the coach there. Finally, does get cleared. Hunter looking for a pounce, but we'll get dead up there by coach and shut down by team and co. And uh, we're going to see Sars keep pushing up here. They're sitting at a pretty nice health bonus after that tank. Um, it could have been, yeah. it could have been, you know, thought about whether to commit the tank so early as we saw the SI did, or do, but, uh... I thought that was a bold move, you know, uh, because you can get LOS there for ages, just days and days on end, and they opted to commit him right away on it, and then they only had a single boom, so that didn't help either, they were completely clear to run around and juke the tank on it one boomer time again, getting, getting Indeed, that will be the end of attack. Uh, very nicely taken there by Voodoo Boy, shutting that nut jockey. And they also figured if we all jump in the elevator, the stumble won't affect us. So uh, they were hopping around like little bunny rabbits and, you know, and festivities for Easter. Easter was last weekend. I know. But it's still it's still kind of Easter. I mean, come on. Watch out! Uh, I, I just know Fig sitting there face bombing right now, but we have an attack coming in here as he's face bombing. Nice tribe and going out Cyrus, proxying on two of them. That's gonna be actually quite a bit of damage going out onto the survivors uh, via that spit that did land onto Nick there for a little bit. And uh, Fig says it's my resting face. Survivors are again a good spot. I mean, they the toughest part of the map is already behind them, okay. and they've got decent health on it. Some real first aid. But which is coming up, which helps in Infected's favor. But will they be able to capitalize? Hopefully can. We see Boomer actually missing his rocket spawn around the corner. I'm guessing he got hooked up on the SI ladder that is uh, right in front of him. If we go to the Boomer's POV, I can only assume, yeah, he got hooked up on that little ladder there. And so he's going to hop up on the ledge. You know, Boomer existence. Oh, well, he still gets on to one. Yeah, showing us how that boomer arc works. Uh, we do have two SI currently spawned up already looking to get this attack underway. With that being the jockey and smoker. There is a witch in play though, so they're probably going to win it from the witch. She's sitting right there at the corner pretty much. And uh, they're going to try and pick that jockey, it looks. Oh, shit. Watch out. Survivor's taking no chances. They're just going to... Yes, yeah, so I was definitely taking the. I mean, beautiful hit, though. Beautiful hit. Jockey getting the, the in cap out onto Alice and Smoker pulling one survivor through the spit, and then Charger also taking another survivor through the spit. And this could be a lot of damage on the survivors. What was the health bonus? They were sitting at a 544 health bonus. That attack alone dropped them over 300 health. 
Uh, 310 health bonus to be exact. Down to 234 where they sit right now. And Alice is actually way in the back here. And this could be some separation that the SI are looking for. They could definitely make a hit happen here. Uh, one star was actually already dropped inside the building up ahead. And it's Nick Rochelle waiting for Alice to catch up. Smoker will spawn up, gets a pull onto Alice here. Not going to be able to get him off the ledge, though. Looking for bonus. But he's having some difficulty. Reloading. Jackie does land out onto Alice, though. Very good separation, but maybe have one attack left for infected. Smoker's still up, though. Most certainly is, and actually, when they went down that lower route, they actually found a set of pills inside of the garage there. So Ellis will pop them and uh, be able to move faster when he's not in the water. Which is very briefly, but I mean, it's still health. It's going to stop him from taking in cap. Charge just spawn up. He gets to charge back out on Alice. I'm going to be spit down onto him as well. This could potentially be an in cap out onto Bullhead. I believe it will be. And indeed, he will take it down. Boomer also goes out onto Rochelle. And that will be the end of that side attack with just that uh, smoke kind of lurking around there looking for a pole. He's very chipped, though. Oh, he didn't get the pole. They're not. They tried to clear him and they dropped Alice, so. Maybe they are gonna. They might be able to get another attack here. Uh, it might be brief. On the jockey. M2 on the hunter. M2 on the jockey. M2 on the hunter. That spit literally almost killed Nick, I think. Um, actually, Nick isn't even black and white. He hasn't even taken it down, so it couldn't have actually. But uh, Nick did almost take it down there by the hands of that hunter spitter combo. And they will make it a safe one finally, but albeit barely, with the 108 health bonus. Mm -hmm. and I'm actually getting yelled at. Um, the spec hut itself actually shows the health bonus, and I keep checking by typing or pressing my health bonus key. And <laughs> Visor is like, it already shows the health bonus. I love where? you, Visor. Where does it show the health um, it, bonus? If you type spec hut, it actually shows up where it says has survivors. It does show it. I saw it. I actually never oh, noticed it though. Everybody got a gas can? I love you, Visor. I'm sorry. Want to make this trip twice? Yeah. Thanks one. to Visor for the nifty spec cut. I like it. Gives lots of info. Beautiful. Just like Visor. Visor, I loved him. And actually, is that right click in chat? Is that the right click? Because I, I, I caught a brief glimpse of Twitch chat before. And I thought someone said it was right click. And you removed me? I'm kind of upset. I love yeah, you though. With the Mr. Right Click, for those of you who don't know, he's an old school left footed player, but we are, need to say we are going to be going live here with the second half of the third map here. We have to see a big round here from Pirates. Hopefully, they come out with a good 3 400 health bonus round here. Spitter will initiate right off the back, and Boomer going in just as well, getting a nice double boom. I think we're just right over into an SI war room as the tank is committing, and it's going to be a Voodoo Boy. Oh, you got out. If you go out, up. Like if you go out to your left, oh never mind. So when Nick is wait until we have a hit, they're gonna try to push you or something, and then you can just run in and kill them. Well, let's see what we got. If we have a, do you want to go in with this or do you want to try? We'll try to get a hit yeah. for you so you can get yeah. out. Yeah, I'm going. I'm pushing it. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. Try not to take too much shit. My second pass, what's the deal? No, you're on pass. first, 15%. Yeah, now you're on second. Reload! Both of us guys station. No, no, so no, no, no. We get, yeah, whatever we get, we gotta go in with. Before you go in, let us get into position. Alright, you guys ready? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm going down to the street. I'm going down to the street. Reloading. Reloading. Shoot into the L1. Fuck. Get that in cap. Get out. Alright. Now just to try to get far away and rock it. No, I can't. Oh, they got him up already? That was cool. Dude, that was such a bad thing. I'm sorry, guys. 
That's fine. Right, bro, they ran into the street. Hey, sir, I love you, dude. Shout out to hey, sir, I love you. Don't worry. Okay, happy. Alright, uh, you can AI it. Reload. 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 Sorry, I was And we are back. That was a tank in the hands of Monkey, I believe it was, if I'm not mistaken, for Booty Boys. And, uh. No, that was Marvel's, and this time I'm not lying. Oh, it, it could have been, I don't know. I, I won't check. Alright, so it was Marvel's, I lied. I just, I guess Monkey and Marvel sound a lot alike. Because, yeah, uh. Yard, so I know how you feel. Wow. But, uh, yeah, so actually Cyrus didn't do all that bad of a job. At the very end of the, the commit, though, we did see that nice double cap going out with the Charger Hunter. I mean, other than that, Cyrus did an okay job. If they could have nullified that attack, though, completely, they would be sitting in an amazing shape right now for the rest of this uh, map here. And supposedly it was right quick. I love you, right quick. And actually, Zombie, I did neglect your shout out. Let me go ahead and type your name. I closed your chat by accident. I love you, though. Um, so man says, say something like, Buckshot, how would you like your nipple covered in butter or mustard? That's enter, but we do have a death charge going out on the Nick of uh, Pirates, and that will be a death on Yash here. That's going to completely change the mood of this round here. This is like do or die now for Pirates. They have to make it with this health bonus, and uh, they have a long way to go. Right down to 357, so that just really cut their bonus. And distance, too, yeah. It's huge. Dude, we do have a nice boomer initiating here out onto the survivor zone. And Charger got leveled there by Grin of Yar. And uh, that would be an in attack there. I have to quit hitting my right click. See, now I'm thinking of right click and I keep pressing yeah. the right click button on the mouse. I was just gonna say, like, stop Reloading. right clicking your mouse. I got Reloading. right click on my mind. But yeah, for those of you once again tuning in, this is the Another Swiss Sword Tournament, round two of the group stage. And we have actually a nice boom going out under a shell here. And it's between Voodoo Boys and the Pirates, aka Yar. And Charge is going to get railed down. It just charges away. He knows it's over. He's giving it up. Smoke is going to get a brief pull out of Kekria, though, in the back. And that will be an attack, though. Actually, Jackie is already set. Yeah, Jackie is actually opting to go for the Witch instead. And which is going to be triggered. I believe it's after Ellis. And indeed, it is. And Ellis is an Uzi carrier. So this is going to end well for him. He's going to take a full down, losing all of his health bonus there to the Witch. Yeah, most definitely. I believe the witch actually saw Ellis through this little crack here. She was sitting on the little rubble here. I believe she saw Ellis right through this hole in the wall. And um, unfortunately, went right after Ellis, and he wasn't carrying a shotgun for it. Yeah, we will have the survivors. The survivors are currently sitting at a 186 health bonus. I mean, if they can make it with this health bonus, they won't be in that bad of shape. They're definitely going to take another hit, though, uh, with the score difference coming into the next map here. But, um, you know, they have to kind of make it hit here with this health bonus if they want to, you know, keep it somewhat close and not give them another 180. Actually, it's probably already just going to fill out the uh, distance points. But we'll have an attack coming here. Jackie went down to Alice there. And nice double charge inside the room here. I don't believe there's a spit, but Boomer will go ahead and proxy out onto the last survivor. Pushing back out. Charger gets a recharge out onto the shell. And I believe that... No, I thought I heard a Jackie for a second there. I lied, though. But that will be the end of the attack there. And Sarvis took a huge hit, though. But luckily, Razor is still holding that uh, help on us. He was unaffected. Watch where you shooting! They can make it into the safe room with maybe one of their but... Here's a hunter out. Better. Oh, 
you better get up. Beautiful play there by Razor. Actually coming out of the safe room to dead stop that jockey and help out his teammate and getting Rochelle up. And they will make it to the safe room and they're going to have only a 147 health bonus. So they beat Voodoo Boys in the health bonus department. But distance wise, they lost a lot more than that. Distance wise, they only come up with a 490 out of a possible 600. So definitely losing out there. And uh, yeah, we're going to see Voodoo Boys coming into the fourth map here with pretty much a 600. I think it's like a 596 point difference, if I'm not mistaken. I don't think I'm mistaken. I think I'm correct. But it's fourth map, and anything can go in fourth map. And this finale is quite, quite enjoyable as well. They'll be playing finale unless they suppose the losing team decides not to. Um, I don't know if that's the rule. I think you're supposed to play it no matter what. I could be mistaken. I mean, Fig oh. is here, though, so you could tell. Hey, yeah, clear it up for us. Do they have to play Finale? Because generally Europeans don't play Finale, and this is why I was kind of wondering. Um, if they don't want to play the Finale because they're losing, then, yeah, you don't have to. Okay. Yeah, I think like, that's a good rule. Yeah, usually the way that, that well, I'll play more a little bit. Indeed, as we do have the first stack coming in here, the stars are out of safe from Hunter looking for pounce onto the coach who as is at the safe from still and gets the pounce. Spit will bounce off the railing though and back to, to the ground. I'm gonna completely nullify that spit though and make it uh you know it's obsolete in the attack itself. And yeah, as the figure you're saying. So in my thoughts, if a team wants to leave, then the other team can play against bots if they want to, but if they've already won and you know, there's no point in continuing to play. So it's really up to them. That's really all I have to say. Okay. Well, thank you for that. And we will have a tank up in the hands of Pirate's very own Grin. And this is a huge tank, to say the least. And uh, I'm assuming you want an SI Worm as this tank starts committing? Oh, yeah. Let's do just that. What? 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 What the fuck? Did you see that? Reloading. Oh my mm -hmm. god. Don't die, man. Reloading. Stop killing our teammates. Stop attacking my fucking targets. <laughs> Oh, I can't go out from there. No! Oh, <laughs> hey, they're rushing! Hey, do something! Reload! Huh? And as we have Razor supposedly crashing from the server right now, uh, we're gonna send it back over to Cast's Warm, or Cast Channel, I guess if you wanna call it that. But uh, definitely a huge tank coming out here from Grin of uh, Pirates. Um, what, uh, what what can you add to that world? That, he looked like he was having fun, but that car was just not working for him at all. <laughs> like, but he, it worked. He got two of them dead. I mean, all it takes is a double cap. He doesn't have that much health left, but he's got support coming up fairly shortly. Yeah, most definitely. I believe he was sitting at like 875 health before this pause ready up screen came up on my left side. Um, I don't believe I can override that. But I believe, he, yeah, he's, some, he's somewhere around the 800 health range, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, this is most certainly going to be a wipe here for Voodoo Boys. If not right now, definitely a, a double cap in the near future. Um, if they actually make it safe, I might be really surprised. But, uh, right. th I mean, this is definitely the map here for the Pirates to make the comeback that they need more than anything. Um, there's about a 602 point difference right now if the survivors didn't get another point distance, which they're going to. But uh, it's going to be around 630 points probably by the time they, they take the wipe. And uh, that's more than manageable here for Pirates. All they have to do is make the safe room and they'll be back most of those points. Um, and then health bonus alone will put them over the top. And that's going to make for an extremely close finale here. But I believe Pirates know how crucial this next half is going to be for them on the survivor side. That they, this is the round. Like this, they have to make it happen here, right now. They can't leave it to the finale. They need to obviously mm -hmm. make it right now. 
Yeah, fourth map is notorious for comebacks, especially hard rain map four. This one, all kinds of craziness can happen. You just never know. Like we've seen. And yeah, um, Rezor actually disconnected from Mumble as well, so I'm assuming his internet crashed or his computer crashed, one or the other, probably his computer. But uh, once he does get back into Mumble or they find a sub to play, I'm sure we'll get this game back underway for you guys. Um, I'm not too sure who their subs are. I could check, actually. I know there is a roster sheet somewhere in Left of the Nation. I have to go find it fast, though. Actually, never mind, because Razor just reconnected. So he will be uh, the sub for himself. As soon as he gets this game back loaded up and ready to go, we will get this game uh, cast once again for you guys. But he is mumble, so it should be fairly shortly. I mean, if you were Voodoo Boys right now, what would you be thinking? Just, just run? Just, you know, YOLO? Wow. Yeah, I mean, right now, I would run, get as much distance and maintain as much lead as you possibly can at this point. There's only two of you, so, I mean, when you don't have half your team, you can probably run a lot faster than... Yeah, most certainly, but and I'm as... Here. This hunter, that car almost hitting Rochelle though, actually got a lopsidedly hit there by the concrete. Rochelle is going to take it in kept though, most certainly. I doubt she's going to be able to run, outrun that tank with the common attacher. Hunter passes around, Mar around Marvels, looking for this cap, not managing land just yet, and gets uh, shot down there by Marvels. Actually, Rochelle got away from the tank's grips. That's interesting. The car! The car! The car! The car! <laughs> Funny is there's literally there's literally a thread in the left of the nation right now talking about the luck versus skill of cars, and that that car was hit good, but you cannot tell me he predicted for the car to go around Nick, bounce up on the trunk, and then have the engine come slamming back down on Nick. That was absolutely insane. Oh my god, I've never seen a car do that. Nick couldn't move because he was common lock. Oh my god, but we are going to be live here with the second half of the fourth map. This is huge for Yar, aka the Pirates. Um, they have to make this round, if not with health bonus, they don't really have to worry about the health bonus. It's more about the distance at this point. And uh, just the distance alone, if they all make it, will bring them close enough to actually make the finale worth everything. Every little point will matter in the finale. Initial tech coming in here, though. He shut down pretty handily, though. Only a double boom really landing on the survivors here that will affect the rest of this tank here. And Tank will be up in the hands of Monkey. Huge Tank coming in here by him. And you want to send this over to an SI Worm? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do just that. Should I hit another up there? I think you should give one mistake in the middle. Oh, that's close. It's on the It's on us, right? Should I climb up? Yeah, I can sit. Yeah, I'm going They'll probably drop into the street. Do you have one in the street? Do a little bit closer. And that is an absolutely huge tank kill there by uh, Pirates. 
and that is exactly what they needed. It's not even once again about the health bonus. Kekri did eat that car to the face, but it doesn't matter. It's more about the distance right now at this point. Mm -hmm. Distance alone, I think, will be able to bring it quite close. Yeah, they have 700 distance points, and they've got a 500 point lead they've got to catch up on. So easily, if they make it, they have, even with no bonus, they're up 200 points. So. You hear that, honey? Sitting at a 576 health bonus. Smoker's Spitter and Hunter all spawned up. Hunter landing for. Probably one damage. Yeah, it will be the end of that attack. Uh, we really have to see Voodoo Boys right now step up on SI now, though. They need to wipe out this health bonus. I mean, if they make distance, that's fine. It'll be only it'll only be like 100 points or so. But uh, the health bonus alone could be the nail in the coffin there if they allow them to make it with this huge health bonus they're going And right now it's a, five, it's a 560, so it's not too bad. But, I mean, they have to definitely knock that down to a two or 300 range if they... Uh, you know, want to make a comeback in the finale, or if they a miraculous performance here in the finale, that could happen too. But certainly he will be. It was kind of one of those. Yeah, they got a lot of damage, but they didn't really get it on the right person, so. I mean, this is fine so if they want. Still sitting up. Okay. A 500 health bonus. I mean, this is fine if they were to get the kill on to Kekri, that would be amazing. But uh, chances of that happen are slim to none, actually. They're gonna steal, they're gonna steer well clear of that witch. They don't want any part of her. They're saying forget the twenty five points. It's twenty points now. Twenty. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ooh, the call out by Razor. Calling is a teammate Kekri something inappropriate. But we will have a charge to spawn up here before the final attack here. Hunter as well working the way in. Charging missing actually lands out onto Nick in the back. And uh, I'm not too sure how that connect. No clue. The survivors are still staying at a 492 health bonus. This is huge. This is point to come back. Oh, yeah. 28, 68, 25, 48 in favor of Yard, Team Pirate. So, this has been quite the turnaround. Voodoo Boys having the lead the entire game, losing it on map 4. Gotta sting. But at least they have finale. Maybe come back to come back. Reverse the comeback. This could definitely still be a comeback. I mean, once again, it's only a 320 point difference, um, as previously stated. So they're by no means out of this. They're still well in range of taking it. All they have to do is wipe with this first tank and then make it past the tank. And then we have to make boat. They just have to really hold out. And uh, that will pretty much be it for them. They could make it off of that alone. And I mean, they do have in their favor now. I'm not sure how much uh, Team Pirate has has scrimmed this particular finale, but I know in general <coughs> a lot of Europeans don't play finales, so the Americans may have that in their favor for them. Yeah, most certainly. This I mean, this finale gets played a lot. On yeah. The side, so. Like even when the finale still had two tanks, people still played it. It always came down to you know the losing team if they want to play it or not. But uh, mm -hmm. for those of you asking, this is a yeah, definitely. Um, for those of you asking in Twitch chat, uh, my mic is a blue snowball. Uh, it's pretty cool. I love it. Um, some of them are saying though that your mic is a little low. Uh, I'm not too sure what changed between the previous maps and this map though. Yeah, nothing changed. Reloading. Maybe I sat differently. I think maybe if I move back. Uh, it sounds better now actually. Yeah, I got a little louder. But we'll have the first stack initiating here. Charger working his way in. Lands. Nice tri cap laying on this survivor with the Hunter Smoker and Charger briefly landing. Charger got cleared almost immediately though, but Hunter will do quite a bit of damage onto Nick. And then Rochelle also taking a bit of damage from that smoke with the common lock and onto her. And that will be the end of the first hit here for the uh, Team Voodoo Boys. Really good opening hit. Yeah, definitely. I mean, they still have those four pills down inside the building here to work off of. Actually, no, it's only two pills now, correct? 
Yeah, they, they reduced them. It's not for it. Yeah, like two sets of pills, so... You gotta oh, be a little nice. bit more... Hand basket. More thoughtful oh, about when you're going to be using your pills. Well, certainly. Reload, reloading! Charter spawns up. This is his charger. Hunter... Hey, stop it. But jumping, no. Spitter died. Reloading. Reloading Good here. shutdown by Reloading here. Fire. Need someone to sing that fire song that movie. Let's go. Uh, remember how it goes? Go, go. You know the word? Uh, no. I don't believe I do. Unless I'm thinking of something yeah, else. Reloading. I know they know that song. Yeah. Yeah, people were saying if you could turn your mic up. I don't know if you want to do that or it's just sit like, closer to the mic. Oh, well, yeah, it's like an external mic, so... Uh -huh. I mean, I can sit closer. Does that work? I've got my nose in it. So, uh, but, uh, louder. <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> Keep it in your nose. But we have a boomer spawn up gang. A nice, actually, quad boom onto the survivors there. And this tank is going to commit right into this. And tank will be in the hands of, I believe, that is Marvel. So let's send it right over to a Voodoo Boy's War Room. Cracking up. Reloading! We can just blast it one more dead on him. Let's take it out. Nice. That was great. Nice. Nice. Get him another hit. Uh, I'm gonna yeah, respond here in a second. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, I hung the. But do you want to kill him? Are you guys ready? Let's go. I'm going. Oh, uh, sure, sure. Go. They're, uh, they're down low. Just chill, dude. I don't have support. Reload! Oh, yeah, I need to kill him. Yeah. You know that you're cutting down since the hunter died? It's fine, boomers. Really good. Give me a hit. Give me a hit. Give me Hit her with that? Yeah. There's another get, part I'm getting up there. Yeah, I'm getting up there. Gentlemen, I need some help! Are you serious? What? Oh, that was so close. Nice round. Just gonna climb out. Wait, we're gonna have a boomer. Please, boomer. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're passing my help. First. Second, second, second. second. Head on 45. Where'd car go? Shit, shit. I need to, like, go. You need to help me now. Go. Okay. Go. I got it. Alright. Go. Thought you were gonna pull, monkey. That's why I went. Okay. I still have a lot of food. And that will be it for Team Voodoo Boys Tank there, played by Marvels, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think it was Marvels. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're good on that aspect. But uh, yeah, once again, pretty good survivor play there by Pirates. Uh, actually, Kekri initially eating a car and dying up on the, or uh, up on the roof, but he was actually on the ground in the water by the cars. Dude. Marv 2 is in love. Because he kind of, he lost, he, he tried to hit the guy coming up the ladder, he lost his hit and he lost his collateral. So now, they were able to finish him off, because he only had one K left when he got the second end cap with that car. So... 
I think he could have played a little bit more conservatively and perhaps got even more damage or kill. Yeah, most definitely. I know Fig was actually saying the same thing in chat. Um, I was under the same impression as well. I thought he should, after he got that initial kill, I think he should just went back on the roof, capped his LOS on them, and just kept pelting them with rocks and letting the SI keep going and wearing them down. But uh, needless to say, Yash is the only one with any permanent health left remaining on the survivor team at this point in time, with two of them completely bleeding out, no pills left. And, uh, I mean, this, this is kind of what Voodoo Boys needed. They wanted the full white, most definitely. Boat is finally here, though. And, uh, I mean, they have to definitely get the wipe here. They can't allow Yash to make the boat with that health bonus because they are still sitting at quite a huge bonus of 200 for this map. And I, I know every time I'm pressing my health bonus button, Visor is just rolling over in his chair. I don't even know if that makes sense. We're just going to go with it. But uh, we are going to have a track cap working his way here. Rez just get pulled up top. Hunter works his way and gets the pounce out on the Rochelle, though. And Charger will also land out on the coach here. That is the health bonus. That's going to be in spit. He might even take it down. He is going to take it down, most certainly. And there it is. He'll take that down. Now we will see. Uh, Pirates should pretty much be able to make the boat here uncontested. There's no OSI left up. And indeed, they're going to do just that. But the health bonus is gone, obviously. Um, Went from 200 health bonus to 63, just from that charge spit. Yeah, so huge play there by uh, Voodoo Boys in the very end there, knocking out the rest of the health bonus. And that will make the score differential a 892, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, 892, yep. So yeah, the death early on really hurt their bonus and the, the distance too so oh there we go i was like stuck in that cloud thing where i can't move while spectating and stuff let's go <laughs> almost back to the boat what are we supposed to sing on with if we fire up yeah so we're gonna see uh blue boys try and make a comeback here they can do it um how much is this finale worth actually this finale is 1200 health bonus so it's 600 distance so they're gonna need like a 200 what was the point? It was like 890 something. It was 792. Oh. That was a 350 point difference. What do you mean they need a, a 350 health bonus? No, well, well, maybe. I don't know. No, no, don't ask me. Huh. Math ain't my thing. That's interesting. 900 points. Yeah, so it was nine. I couldn't remember. My short-term memory is out the window right now. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna have a stack it. Go ahead. Definitely a good shutdown for the first attack here by Voodoo Boys. Um, definitely, you know, taking what they had to and nothing more. Silver was the only one that really took any damage there, and that was by the hands of the Hunter that did latch onto him for pretty much only one tick of damage. And that will allow Starbucks to go ahead and trigger the last event of this map here, and they're going to close this out for us. But, I mean, once again, they can still pretty much make this. They need about a 300 health bonus. If they get a 300 on the dot, they'll still win. But uh, they all have to make it, you know, we need the full distance, obviously. And that's more than possible. Three people walking away with like a 200 and something health bonus at the very end there. And we will have another attack coming in. Hunter getting shut down by her shot. The gang deads up. The uh, Charger gang absolutely massacred there by the shock and a monkey. And Smoker not faring any better. And that will be that attack here. Voodoo Boy's looking pretty good. Yeah, they're probably very confident, but they have, you know, as long as one of them doesn't die early as they tank, then they can make up the distance that, that Pirates had lost with their early death. So, with any health bonus, I mean, it's entirely possible. Definitely. And we have a boomer initiating here. Ontel is going to draw all the horde towards him. But a hunter jockey charger looking to help out here as the tank does come up. And it will be in the hands of Grin himself for the pirates. Um, this is going to be a huge tank for them as well. They want the white pair. Silva is going to get jockeyed out towards the cars, though. But the tank is way out of play here. He's going to immediately with that. And uh, this is a big decision right here. What war room do you want? 
Yeah, time. I believe we did do infected. All right, so let's send it right over to a pirate's war room and see how they're thinking about taking this wipe out on uh, Voodoo's. Mm. Can you spawn smoker there so I can boom? Mm, right, I I'm see. gonna play uh, with the cow. I'm gonna go in and just. Let's uh... spare him. Let's go over to the cow. Okay, then. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. I see you. Nice. 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 Wait, maybe... Ready? Yeah. Let's... Let's go! Ah! Reloading! Lol, what the fuck? Reloading! Playtime, playtime, playtime. Reloading! Maybe you go in and we support you immediately. Okay, let's go, let's go. I can't see shit! Reloading that thing my way. Watch out! And we are back from that war room of the pirates. Um, once again, another survivor eating car. AKA Bullhead. Um, Bullhead finding that brick, which so happened to be a car, and taking that uh, end cap there. Servers are currently sitting at 519 health bonus though, so I believe they can still win actually. Um, they're gonna they're gonna lose out on about probably 80 points distance wise, probably more than that. But no, 80 80 might be about right there, but almost at the halfway mark. Um, so they need about what are they saying right now? This they needed a 300, so that they make it out with like a 300, almost a 400 health bonus. Charger will get a nice charge out on the silver there, and that's probably gonna be enough damage on the health bonus alone to actually uh, close this out here. And yeah, it's gonna drop the down to a 366 health bonus. Even if they get them up, it's still gonna be too low, I believe, to actually make it count. Even if they were to make the boat right now with this health bonus. But uh, a amazing play there by Pirates in the last two maps, making a comeback out of nothing. And uh, just showing us how it's done. Never down and out. This shit will help. I'm going to get right. I hear Hunter. So Boomer will go ahead and be popped by the hands of Monkey himself. But, uh, I mean, right now the health bonus is currently 339. I think that's still too low. Don't quote me on that. They might prove me wrong somehow, but they are going to attempt to make the, the boat here with this health bonus, and hopefully, uh, you know, it's going to be close regardless. I think they're going to make the safe room slash boat. It's just a matter of how much health bonus are going to have when they step upon it. Here goes Survivors running off the roof. Smoker charges, smoker back with a hunter from the side. Smoker's a nice pull on the silver. Now can be that's our Joe getting blocked by the boat itself. And Hunter will also be cleared very fast, smoking a brief ball on a silver in the backfield. And that will be the end of it. They didn't win, did they? Wait. 324. No, they're going to be short by like 50, 60 points. Yeah, they're going to... 3440 to 3388. Such a close game. That was insane. GG. Dude, it was. That's extremely close. We've been blessed with some really close games so far in these first two rounds. Like, extremely close. We had another game back on D... No, not Detour. Had Death Toll. It was like a 40-point game. No. I think it was, it was like 16 points, actually. Um, it was incredibly close, and we casted that one as well. But, uh... 
incredibly good play on both sides by both Voodoo Boys and, of course, Pirates. And congratulations to Pirates for the win. And, uh, I mean, do you have any shots you want to go ahead and give out?